Thank you for joining us. Our morning outlook will focus on the euro dollar, recent developments, and the potential impact on the markets. Let's hear from Greg in our trading room. The euro dollar pair saw a minor dip of 0.1% in the last session. According to the stochastic RSI, we are in an oversold market. The dollar yen pair exploded 1.8% in the last session. According to the stochastic RSI, we are in an overbought market. The gold dollar pair traded sideways in the last session. According to the Williams indicator, we are in an overbought market. Apple stock saw a minor rise of 0.3% in the last session. The stochastic RSI is giving a negative signal. Thank you. Moving on to the latest updates in world financial news. The dollar hit a three-week high against the euro after the ADP national government report showed U.S. private payrolls increased more than expected in September, ahead of Friday's highly anticipated jobs data. The S&P 500 and the Nasdaq edged higher, but were near two-week lows as investors watched for an escalation in geopolitical tensions in the Middle East, while a survey soothed concerns about a rapid cooldown in the U.S. labor market. Markets remained cautious as Israel and the U.S. vowed to strike back after Iran attacked Israel. Iran's attack on Israel has rekindled the allure of safe havens and oil prices have surged, but with no clarity yet on how the Middle East situation will evolve. Investors are treading tentatively. Their key question is whether Iran's strike marks an escalation or is more of a one-off backlash at Israel. Thank you. And now let's go through today's major economic event. The US ISM Services PMI will be released at 14 GMT, Australia's exports at 130 GMT, Japan's 10Y bond auction at 335 GMT. The Eurozone's producer price index will be released at 9 GMT, the French 10Y bond auction at 9 GMT, Australia's trade balance at 130 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log in tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial market.